Hey sisters, it's Frankie from Frankie's Naturals here and welcome back to my vlog. So, oh my god, I could not wait to show you guys my vegan fried egg recipe. I've been working on it for like three weeks now and oh, I cannot tell you guys how much this tastes exactly like eggs. Like, I don't miss them whatsoever and this recipe is so quick and easy. Uh, I just can't wait to show you guys. Okay guys, so I spent my entire boyfriend, I mean girlfriend's rent paycheck on uh, a pantry full of ingredients for this recipe. So I hope you guys like it. For the egg white, we need a quarter cup of rice flour and a quarter cup of soy or coconut milk because we're plant-based and regular milk is for babies. You also need a pinch of salt and a teaspoon of water for the egg white. For the yolk, uh, you need some pumpkin or butternut squash so we can trick ourselves into thinking that it's the same color as actual eggs. You need two tablespoons of nutritional yeast and oh my god guys, this tastes so much like cheese, it's unbelievable. Uh, two tablespoons of corn flour. I have organic whole grain corn flour and a quarter teaspoon of black salt. Uh, this is what makes this recipe. Uh, it's so eggy tasting and if you guys can't find this in your local supermarket, it might be in like a health food store. I got mine online uh, packaged in plastic uh, just like everything else because who cares about the ocean? Uh, then you need a quarter teaspoon of uh, black pepper. I use uh, organic Italian black peppercorns. And here we have some Italian olive oil, just two tablespoons for the egg yolk. So what's an egg without some avocado toast? And I had this avocado flown in all the way from Kenya and they recently banned avocado exports from Kenya but I was fortunate enough to get the last one and here I have some organic soft wheat bread. This is my favorite uh, because I spend uh, $7 for a loaf of this. It, it has to be healthy for you despite having 20 ingredients in it. Okay guys, so now we're gonna mix our egg white. All we need to do is put a quarter cup of rice flour with about a quarter cup of the coconut or soy milk, just a teaspoon of water, and then a pinch of salt. And you don't want this to be too runny, more like a, a thin paste. Okay, so we're gonna set this aside and make the egg yolk. Okay guys, so it wouldn't be a vegan recipe without a blender. And here I have a Ninja Blender. My boyfriend, I mean, my girlfriend was supposed to give me a Vitamix for my birthday, but oh well. So we're just gonna combine all the egg yolk ingredients. Here we have the blanched pumpkin, 170 grams. We're gonna add two tablespoons of water, two tablespoons of the corn flour, the quarter teaspoon of the black salt, a quarter teaspoon of black pepper, two tablespoons of olive oil, and it's okay to have a little bit of fat. This is the only oil I'm having all week. And then our two tablespoons of nutritional yeast. And I'm just gonna add a pinch of salt to this as well. Okay, so now we're gonna go for a ride in the blender. Woohoo! Okay, so after we blended it up, it's like a slightly thicker paste than the egg white. And oh my god, guys, this tastes just like egg yolks. Oh my god, that's so crazy. So I have my pan on a medium heat. I'm just gonna add a little bit of olive oil. And then we're gonna spoon in our egg white mixture. Cover it for about 10 seconds. Okay, and then after 10 seconds, we're gonna spoon on our egg yolk. 
Okay, now I'm gonna add a little bit of water to the pan to help steam the top. And then we'll put the lid back on for another 30 seconds. Okay guys, so there you have it, our vegan fried eggs. Okay guys, so here I have my avocado that I mashed up like baby food because vegans eat like children and need to puree everything. And I just toasted my bread a little bit to make it a little bit carcinogenic. But hey, only meat is supposed to have carcinogens when you heat it. Oh my god, guys, how good does that look? It's almost like it looks fake, like Play-Doh or something. Oh my god, guys, I've been starving all day. I only had a bowl of oatmeal for breakfast, and then I had a smoothie bowl, and then I just had a little bit of an apple as a snack, and it's only like 11.30 a.m., so I need a little something else. Mmm, oh my god guys, this is so good. Oh, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments if you like this recipe. So, if you guys would like to support this channel, please subscribe and share the video. If you guys want to check out some of my hygiene products, you can go on my website, frank-tofano.com and check those out. I also have a bunch of these products that I used in my recipe today on my Amazon shop. And if you guys would like to reach out to me for any amazing vegan recipes and some cooking lessons, you can reach out to me via email or through the contact form on my website in the description.